Hey everyone, SuperAndrew64 here. If you're one of the lucky ones here and were able to get yourself a Famicom Classic Edition, you notice that there's one big flaw with this system. It's the controllers. They are hardwired into the system and the, sh the cords are pretty short. I think they're about two feet and there's no way to extend them because they're hardwired into the system. With this video, I'm gonna show you a, an easy solution to solve this problem. It may be a little on the pricey side, but if you're willing to spend the money, I, th I think it's pretty worth it. So what I've basically done here is gotten a mini HDMI monitor. It is connected to the uh, Famicom with a short HDMI cable. Also, i powering the Famicom with a power USB power bank right here. So the only thing that really needs to be plugged in is the HD monitor. Now you can also use this with the uh, NES Classic and the SNES Classic, but I really don't see a need for it because you can get extension cables for the controllers. But it's always nice to have options to play your classic Nintendo game systems. Okay, so let's test out some gameplay here. So let's play, play Super Mario World. I have to put up the volume. Yeah, so this is a lot easier for me rather than sitting at a TV far away and try to get a really long HDMI cable. That also could be another solution as well. So don't limit yourself just to this. Uh, okay, there we go. So yeah, pretty simple. Oh, okay, I died. But yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it on the gameplay. I'll take a look at the monitor now and show you what the features on it are. Here's the monitor. It's a 1080p screen and it's seven inches. Uh, so on the side, you can see all the different ports here. There's uh, AV, HDMI, and uh, VGA. So you can cut the monitor, any HDMI device, and even older things if you uh, desire to. Now this stand here also comes off, so you can Attach this to maybe like a tri a camera tripod if you need it to be a little higher rather than sitting on a table. Um, yeah, so overall, I would recommend I would recommend this if you're looking for an easier solution for your Famicom. But also other ways you can get a longer HDMI cable, a uh, longer USB power cable, so you, you don't have to worry about um, sitting too close to your TV. Yeah, so be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. I'll tr again, I try to upload on a weekly basis. Uh, I have a lot of things here to talk about, so stay tuned for more content. Thank you, everyone.